sola de do, do de la so fa mi re do. Nailed it. How are you doing, everyone? Yeah, I know that's a that's kind of a stupid question in 2020. Why do I still wear this mask? This is fucking stupid. Maybe I should have waited recording this. Look at this. It's painted. This mask was actually already painted by the time I had uploaded that one video, but you know, the video was maybe filmed like three weeks prior. So yeah, um, I got bored. I just realized I'm not looking at the camera all the time. <laughs> I want to apologize for my teeth because they are a little yellow and there's nothing I can do about it. Except for not forgetting to brush my teeth. Excuse the mess that is my bed. I have been hoarding these things on my chair and I am not ready to reorganize everything just so that my bed looks a little nicer. Like, I mean, do I look like the kind of person who would give a shit about this? Yeah, that's what I thought. I don't know if you've noticed, but I have like these uh, Powerpuff Girls plushies, even though uh, Buttercup is uh, covered by that one glorious drawing of mine. My mom specifically bought me a picture frame so that I could frame something that I drew. Beautiful, isn't it? There she is, falling over. I'm sorry, Buttercup, you, you do not deserve this. Uh, those are actually like newer plushies because I could not find them anywhere when I wanted to rebuy them and the old ones were thrown away because of a certain person. <laughs> uh, so for like, I think it was my 16th birthday, my mom got like completely new plushies, the exact same that I had, except that I'm not gonna show you, but they actually have like glittery dresses and this, this frustrates me. Bubbles, for some reason, doesn't have a normal dress. She has this, like, I don't know, this kind of pink kind of dress. I mean, it's, it looks cute, but then she also looks away. What are you looking at, huh? I'm right here. Although I guess it's still better than that creepy little thing that I once bought. Just look at its eyes. Why did I think that was a good idea? Still kind of cute, though. Scary as shit, but really cute. And then there's this gal. I actually feel really bad for her because I don't remember her name, but like, c come on. You can hear it insulting you. Then there's this plushie that my best friend got me from Japan. I don't know how to refer to her, but you know who you are. Thank you. In case you don't really recognize who this is supposed to be, it's like a bear version of Deku from My Hero Academia. And it's like, it's so weirdly creepy. But also so cute. How does that work? Why do companies keep on doing this? It's got, it's got cute little feet though. It's adorable. Then I have a car. I don't know what to call it. Like it's not a pig, so you can't call it a piggy bank or whatever it was called. Something something with pig. Piggy. Anyway, so my dad got me this like a year ago in hopes that I would get my license. Guess what I don't have yet. <laughs> then I have a Rubik's Cube. Don't ask, I, I honestly don't know why it's in my room, I never use it. Although I, 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 got, I got a scythe. That counts for something, right? Actually, I don't have only one Rubik's Cube. I got... Oh god, where the fuck is this now? Uh, it's difficult enough to solve it. Why does it have to be difficult to find it as well? Come on, where is it? You know, my mom's saying that I should have tidied up my room. Might have had a reason, but I'm not sure. It's got to be in... <laughs> oh wait, oh wait, I think I know, I know. Aha! Uh -huh. Numero deux! Yeah, yeah, I didn't even try on that one. I, I think I just left it. It's, it's not worth it. I actually have an OC who's like really good at these and I have no idea how I would make them solve this without me being able to solve it. Help. Then there's Bendy who 
I've never actually gotten very deep into the fandom, but I got it from my bestie once again. Thanks. Okay, my entire shelf is filled with things that my bestie got me. And it is the only piece of personality I have in this room. So yeah, thank my bestie for giving me a personality, I guess. <laughs> you also might remember that he went through some, um... Trauma. So yeah, let's, let's not bother him too much. I don't even remember where I got this one from. Uh, it just exists. Dance to pain away, Lilo. Dance to pain away. Then there are these two things that are, I think, the only actual anime figurines I have. And look! It gets to be taller, at least in some universe. You have no idea how long I waited to make this joke. Uh, then we have the latest edition, which is... What was it called again? Moon Monkey? Or Night Monkey? Or something like that. It's from the second Tom Holland Spider-Man movie. It was okay. I still love you, Tom Holland. <laughs> so, why did I just spend 20 minutes to just show you what I got in my room? Does anything in 2020 make any sense anymore? No, but seriously, um, I finally got a new laptop. I finally got the licenses again for the stuff I need. So we should be back on track with the videos, except that I'm going to university now. Well, going is a very strong word. Uh, you may ask what happened to the aspiration of becoming an illustrator. It's still there. The art schools just said no. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just trying to get a bit hang of things again. I've been a little bit, not exactly depressed, like not seriously, just a little bit demotivated because <laughs> I wonder why that could be. So I'm gonna go a bit into video editing because I kind of missed messing around with it a little bit and, you know, maybe show my face a little bit more often. But who knows? Might be fun. I also want to say that um, I'm actually having the sketch commissions open, so if you want to have a little sketch, uh, you can DM me through Twitter, or Instagram, or if I'm gonna pop it here, the email address to contact me. The camera is distracting me so much. Why? Unfortunately, I can't do proper commissions these days. It would take too long and I would just not be able to do them properly. So sketches are at least, you know, a safe bet that I can at least get them done. So, um... Yeah, you can commission me for a sketch and then maybe have another artist to complete it. I don't know, kind of like an indirect collab or something. I don't care. You can do it with the sketch whatever you want. I don't care. I just want the money. Also, just to make sure we're on the same page. Uh, yeah, that Undertale animatic thing. Yeah, that's not gonna happen anymore. It's not that I wouldn't be capable of doing it anymore. But, you know, at this point, half a year, over half a year has passed at this point. So... It's kind of irrelevant at this point, and I mean, Undertale has been irrelevant for quite a while, except for recently, because of the anniversary, and because of the new updates and stuff, and... Who am I kidding? It's gonna haunt me for the rest of my life. I really don't want to promise doing certain types of videos anymore, because I just see that the moment I do, they're just not actually getting done. Especially when it's something like so big as an animatic and stuff. I've never actually worked on an animatic before, so for me to uh, jump into something like this without any plan whatsoever, with a 50 minute long video at best... Yeah... I might think about replaying the game again, but then the whole, you know, genuine reactions are just kind of lost, so you're gonna have to tell me if you want that anyway, so that at least you get to actually see my beautiful face doing that as well. My teeth are still yellow, why am I smiling? However, I am in fact working on a new video idea, which is just, um, basically you just tell me what you want to be drawn, just whatever it is. Can be a character, can be an animal, can be memes, can be a scene, can be a plot, can be a microphone that sends it away constantly. I mean, on Twitter I already got the suggestion on the B guy from the B movie, so I mean, you can go wild, man. I'm not gonna say exactly what I'm planning to do because it's like really a stupid vague idea and I kind of want to keep it that way <laughs> until it's out. Uh, so just maybe write in the comments what you want to be drawn. 
can be a scene, can be a character, and again, it can be pff, can be fucking anything. So you know, just just type away. You can also write the end of the world. I mean, it's kind of what's happening anyways right now. So just go wild. Actually, I forgot to show you a few plushies, so don't you dare leave yet. I'm watching you. So here are my main plushies that I have in my bed. So this is my dog plushie and uh... Yeah, he's had better days. And this is um... I don't know what to tell you. If you don't know who this character is, then I gotta ask, how did you get internet connection? This plushie is actually supposed to be hung, but I removed the strings because, um... Yeah, I don't need a floating Pikachu over my bed. Yeah, no thank you. It's however a bit disturbing how it's like always on this side. Basically broke his neck for this position. I'm so sorry. I deserve better. And this is Puffles from Veronica from Hindenburg. I lied. I don't remember his last name. You like to pull you up. Have you ever seen a baby toucan? Those are cute as fuck. It's baby. Little baby. I'm actually kind of surprised I don't have any Undertale merchandise. Like, with the three years that I spent in that fandom, you would have thought I would have something, but nope. Just drew a bunch of weird stuff. Not that kind of weird stuff, you see. So, uh, yeah, as you see, I've lost track. I don't know what uh, this video is even supposed to be about. I probably don't even know what kind of title I'm gonna give it. So, yeah, this is probably gonna be another filler video, I, I guess. I, I don't know. So, yeah, I hope you're doing well, that quarantine hasn't broken your spirits or sanity. And for the ones who live in the US, I am so sorry for you guys. Jesus Christ. You, you, you need a hug? Uh, I can give you a hug. We, we, come, come on. Come, come with the hug. Blah. Also, to just quickly mention, I see in a lot of videos how people point certain things in a video out very quickly. So um, just to just to be sure about something, this, this isn't from an accident or anything. This is just the way I was born. I can draw with it. I can write with it. I can kind of hold a mug with it. I can definitely not play a flute with this thing. It's not a big deal. I mean, I'm I'm sure I'm making it more of a big deal. I just thought I'd mention it. It's 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 just a special hand. Yeet. So yeah, I hope you're having a good day and well. <laughs> and see you next time. Am I um Am I allowed to move yet? Hello? I hope the microphone isn't picking up on my parents fighting. Yay! Oh fuck.